Hi guys, so I am the lucky adopter of two wonderful rescue rats and I thought I would take this opportunity to show you my trip to get them and to say a little bit about how to settle new rats into your home especially rats who may be skittish or may come from a background where they weren't necessarily handled all that often. He is definitely the more adventurous of the two. Oh, nope, you're going to prove me wrong. Oh, that's the first time that he's come out since we picked him up, since we picked them up. He found the inside and he has stayed there. Hi boys. Hi boys. These guys are big. They're probably a good double the size of the baby girls. I'm excited. I've wanted really big rats for a really long time. Every rat that I've had before this has been a really small girl or a really small boy. So I'm super excited for this. You guys are so pretty, aren't you? Hi. Aww. So, yeah, we're heading back now. And how long is it? How far? Another 90 miles. Woohoo! So... You'll see more from them when we get home. Okay, so we made it home and I've got the bottom half of my Martin's cage set up for them. I've got the top blocked off because I forgot the liners. So, oops, my bad. But they're going to get to stay in the bottom half here, so. Hopefully this will go well. And yeah, the Martin's just sitting on top of the Critter Nation. So... They're going to be right by the girls from the start. That'll help to get them used to each other's smells. But because I got them from a rescue that already does quarantines, I don't have to worry as much. Oh, boy. I don't have to worry as much about quarantine. Um, if you're getting your rats from a rescue that doesn't do quarantine, then you definitely need to wait three weeks before... Ooh, don't get out the side. Before allowing them to be in the same airspace as your current rats. It's okay, boy. There you go. Are you gonna come out easier? Are you gonna, no, no you're not. There you go. There you go. So yeah, if you're, the rescue you're getting them from doesn't do a pre-quarantine, then you're definitely want, going to want to quarantine them in a different airspace so that's like a different house that's not a different room that's a different house uh, but since my rescue does quarantine I'm going to go ahead and just put them in the same room because I already know that these guys are okay so they're a little freaked out they're a little jumpy just getting used to everything and they've just been neutered two days ago so they're still a little on edge from that too I'm sure <laughs> You like it? It's bigger than the carrier. It's bigger than the carrier you were in, huh? You can't go up there. <laughs> Hopefully they won't be able to get that loose. If they do, oh well. I mean, they'll just... I'll just fix it whenever I notice. Hopefully they won't do it in the middle of the night. You like it? You guys like it? <laughs> Aw, they're so jumpy. So yeah, these are my two boys. <laughs> they're so big. They're so big. Hi. A little treat? What did I do with the bag of treats? 
Here, let's do Cheerios since I don't know what I did with the Yogi's. You guys want Cheerios? Hi. I don't know if you're going to bite me. <laughs> hey, baby. You want Cheerio? Here, here. There. Looky. Looky right there. Well, he knew it was in my hand, so. There we go. Hey, baby. You want one, too? Oh, that was so gentle. That was much gentler than the girls take them. That was so nice. You boys like treats? You like Cheerios? I really thought you were about to start eating the rat food again. <laughs> the girls are going to get jealous because I'm sure they can hear this. Quinn's trying to get out. <laughs> Quinny Quinn. Hey, Quinny Quinn. <laughs> nope, not interested anymore. Do you want another one? Yeah. And I'm just trying to give them some treats to help them get used to us and feel safer and know that we're good people. We're not going to hurt them. So. <laughs> Especially if your rats are skittish, it's good to give them a couple not so unhealthy treats when you first get them. Because then they'll start associating you with food and good things and all of that. All right, so I'm going to let these guys just get settled in a little bit more, get used to this cage and the room and everything. So I hope you guys enjoyed, and I hope you're as excited about these boys as I am. Have an awesome day. Bye, guys.